This is Big 2 News at 10. The, the one thing I would add is we're, we're always in need of foster families. It's a big need in the area. Uh, we're woefully short on foster families. A lot of kids get sent out of area. While local organization is making it its mission to raise awareness for foster children in our area. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Jian Kim. Now, Big News Jen Geik said, joining us now live in studio. Jake, you were at their annual fall festival today, an event dedicated to recruit foster parents and also to restore separated families. So, break it down for us. Gian, the f event was catered uh, to bring all of these families and agencies together as well. The organizers say that there's a huge need to help um, these families in crisis right now, given the economy, and they want to do whatever they can to keep families together. On the northwest side of Midland, Foster Restoration Ministries is working to keep families together. We work with foster and adoptive families as well as CPS and agency workers such as High Sky and Buckner and we just try to create support in the community for foster and adoptive families as well as kinship families. The organization hosting its annual fall festival, it creates a space for families to come together and offer support. Kids could participate in face painting, horse riding, a petting zoo, and other fun activities. Foster families in attendance were also fed completely free of charge. It's just a fun night to get away. Uh, we generally do these twice a year, uh, one in the spring, one in the fall. Uh, we canceled our spring, uh, and so here we are in the fall doing um, our fall family event. And so we just tried to have um, everyone out here to just celebrate the fall and, and have a little bit of fun in the middle of the season. But amidst all the fun, an important message. They want children to always grow up around family. They say once a child leaves his or her home, odds are they don't go back. We, you know, most of the kids, you have a 90% chance, if you get removed from your home, you have a 90% chance of going outside of your own community, so outside of your county. You have a 60% chance of going uh, as far as like 100 miles away outside of our region. And so what we want to do is build up a community. The Bonnie and Tyler want to do it through Boston Restoration. At the Attic, we want to do this as well, to, to build up a community that um, comes in and supports these families, supports not only foster families, but the families that are in crisis. The idea is that kids Kids that end up in foster care in the Permian Basin stay in the Permian Basin. They say 2020 has been a difficult year for so many families and that they are here to help everyone that they can. Information to volunteer and get involved with Fostering Restoration Ministries is on our website, yourbasin.com. Reporting the studio, Jake Ike said, Big Two News.